All right, welcome to Small Mouth Crush. We are wearing our jerseys. Well, sort of. Is your name Travis? Absolutely. No. It's Big Crank Jimmy. No, it's Jimmy Big Time. Jimmy Big Time. I have no idea that, what this episode's gonna bring. Yeah, but it might be good. Coming out. Mm -hmm. You might be wondering why we're wearing jerseys. First of all, I like this jersey. I haven't worn this jersey since I left the Elite Series. And, uh, you look good though, bro. Years ago. Yeah, it feels good yeah. to be back. I like the hat. Here. Well, the Looking hat. Good. Hats to, yeah. You need a shave, that's for sure. It's all good. How do I look? You look great, man. Right? You I'm, see what the back says, bro? What's it say? Manson! Awesome. Travis. I love it. Fish dirty? Man. Yeah, I like it, man. Mercury. I've never had a real now Elite Series Pro jersey on. Well, that was my Opens jersey. Yeah, I know. That's up, bro. This is This is the Elite jersey here, buddy. Man, dear. So I what? guess this whole show is going to be about sponsorship? Is I think so, you, yeah. Is that why you made me get all dressed up? I, I think you look great, by the way. We should do videos in these shirts all the time. Okay. But Perfect. this one needs to be clean, bro, because it smells like dog shit. So let's talk about sponsorship. All right, let's get into it. Yep. So do you have any questions? I have none whatsoever. Oh. Well? Well, do, why would I have questions? Be, oh, I get it, because you're an elite pro at one point, and you had sponsorships, and I never did. I guess that could I be. I guess that could be the reason. All right. I did have some, though. My sponsors paid. Did they? They paid me to stay away. All right. <laughs> they just said, don't put your name on our boat. We'll pay you to keep the name off the boat. Sounds like Seriously, a Seriously, I got no deal. stickers on my boat. That's awesome. Yeah. No. I got no money in my pocket either from them, but right, right. I used it all. I hear you. Drinking. So, but I don't, I don't do that anymore. Right. But, so let's talk about how to get a sponsor. Okay. Well, first of all. Let me get my notes. Yes. You know me. I always take <laughs> notes. You do. I do. No, I mean, the, the, the way to get a sponsor is you, you have to show value for... I wrote that down, bro. What? You got to bring value to the market for that sponsor. Listen, if I had a small bait company and I was doing 400000 in sales a year... That's small? I would... Yeah, after overhead and expenses... Underhead, you make, overhead, You might make hundred grand. Yeah. Right? Okay. So how much of that... Are you really going to want to put towards an individual angler right. to help push your products when there's a lot better options out there? I have an answer for that, Okay, though. go ahead. You got to equal in value what they're giving you. Absolutely. You understand me? Yeah. Like, if you're giving me $6,000 worth of little critters, mm -hmm. right? Right. I got to get you at least $6,000 in sales, minimum. Right, minimum. exactly. But then you're just breaking even. Mm -hmm. So you're either going to be obsessed or you're going to be fucking breaking even. Right. You know what I mean? Yeah. So you either got to work with this. You got to get that sponsor over and above what he's asking from you. Exactly. Seriously. You have to do some work, man. A big part of getting sponsors mm -hmm. and keeping sponsors is the public. You agree? I agree. You got to be a people person. Exactly. If you're a turd, you ain't going to help. No. No. Absolutely. You gotta be able to sell market Please. product. One hundred percent. And it doesn't even mean product knowledge. It just means being excited, being enthusiastic, and just getting it Why out there. Why do you keep man. touching? Me I like don't know, that. bro. One <laughs> of these days we're gonna hold hands. I can't help it. I talk with my hands a lot. All right. Do you want me to move over there? No, you're good. All right. So. Okay. What? Did... Anyways. What's up? <laughs> I, <don't know. laughs> I was smelling you, bro. Okay. That smells actually like an Italian hoagie. It could be. Like you wore that once when you were sweating real bad. No. Mm -mm. It stinks. Anyways. Either that or you need deodorant. Right. The other, bro. I see guys practicing with them on. Does that make any sense? It does because they're supporting the companies. Practicing? Sure. Well, if someone at the boat launch sees you. What would you just say? Boat launch? If someone at the <laughs> boat Scooby launch Doo. sees you getting in your boat and you got a cool looking... Couple power oh, yeah. poles. Hey, yeah, I can I can see it. I can see how that conversation would go. Hey, how are you? I'd like to buy one of each on your shirt. <laughs> I'll pay the shipping, get them out tomorrow. Never seen it happen is a bunch of bullshit. I ways to promote your companies, right? I think social media is a huge platform. Social media is huge. I get so many inboxes. As soon as you friend a guy, boom, right there inbox. Yeah. You ever notice that? That burns my ass. Yeah. You know what else burns my ass? Flames about that high. Right. Drives me crazy. <laughs> I hate it. I don't get it. Why do they, in, the minute you get inboxed, mm -hmm. boom, they want to sell you something. Right. I got a lot of stuff to sell, but I... What does that say? 
It's Ken Sports. I Who is born. that? Kakawana, Wisconsin? It's Kakana. <laughs> Kaka I bought my first boat, my first brand Are new boat. Are we filming? Yeah. I bought my first <laughs> brand new boat from Ken Sports. What was it? What'd you buy? Uh, a Nitro. A Triton uh, 21. X HP. Or Did I see it? The blue one. Yeah, the silver one. The blue one. Silver. Wasn't it blue? I got a blue legend right now. Oh, I thought the first one you. I had a red one. You sold it to the guy in Massachusetts. Yeah. All right, that was blue. Yep. All right. Silver. All right, same thing. Okay. Silver, blue, bluish silver. Right. You right. like my watch? Yes. I'm sponsored by Mavado. Are you? Yes, I am. There you go. Keeps perfect time on the water. Right. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Yep. So battery wears out. Right. I got to do this to wind my watch I'm, up. Uh, I'm surprised you didn't bring Nantucket. Oh, Nantucket uh, Nectar or yeah. the Honest Abe's uh, Golden uh, Tea? Yeah, so yeah. You, got, you can be really deceived in the products that you're promoting I, well. I believe that too. He was pimping the uh, iced tea the other day, saying how it was organic. Yeah. If you look a little further, that company is actually made by Coca-Cola. So, that's Poison a bunch of... corn syrup, bunch, GMO, it's a bunch of the crap. SA more. No, you're good. Get you're on good. the bandwagon. Here's one thing you want to know about sponsorships. Mm -hmm. If somebody brings you on board, now correct me if I'm wrong, right? A lot of these guys out there, they get so juiced up about getting these sponsors and they start emailing and faxing and YouTubing and, get, and they're trying to get this deal and they I say, hate, okay. I hate getting the faxes from them. Oh, there's no more faxes. I, I have know. a fax machine I'm still. Sure you do. Yeah. But here's the deal, right? Right. These guys, they, they get this 10 to 15 to 20% off, mm -hmm. and all of a sudden they think they've arrived and they're, and they're basically a sponsored guy. Yeah. Here's my problem with that. I can go to Dick's, Bass Pro Shops, Cabela's, here, and get 20% off anywhere I want. Well, not technically here. Not here? Yeah. No, I'll steal all your sale. shit, bro. I'll steal every bit. Yeah, you don't know, but I've been taking little bits I and pieces. Right? So my point is, if you think a 20% is a sponsorship, you're out of your mind. They're using you to promote their products that you can buy at any store for the same dang price. In certain situations. Agreed? In certain situations. Absolutely. Now, what if I can get 50% off? Let's talk about the cost of a jersey. Okay. If you can't even get the cost of a jersey out of one of your sponsors, don't buy one. No. 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 Why would you put out $100, 100 and a quarter for men's like you, large, XL, right. so you're a very big fella, um, large, right. mine's probably a couple bucks cheaper, mm -hmm. but why would you take and spend your hard-earned money and buy a jersey and have put other people's name on it so they can advertise on your jersey? So you look cool in the way You're a $100 line. billboard. So you look cool in the way line. I look cool in the way line anyway. Oh, I smoke in the way in lines. <laughs> I, bet you I do. do. <laughs> I always got the guy shit. Yeah, I put that cigarette out. I'm like, wrong. <laughs> Just keep puffing away. But I cop it like that, and I'm like, right. like that. You ever see me do it? You, you no, will this year. Right. Yeah, I'll have two, one in each hand this right, year. Right, right. I'm, I'm a firm believer of promoting tobacco products. Right. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Every hillbilly out there chews. Sure. It's said I smoke. It's unacceptable. They chew. They're allowed to do it. And How you, does that? Even that's just a rant I had. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I rant. I'm usually a pretty positive dude, but I fucking <laughs> negative dude. Right, like, right. Ugh. Oof, yeah. yeah. You all right? Yeah. It's a little chilly in here. It is. You have the heater on? No, we don't have heat in this garage. Not mm. yet. Let's, what else do you want to talk about? Mm. All right. So let's see. Let's see who's the best marketer here. What do you mean? Between me and you? Yeah, we're going to have a little contest oh right now. Oh my God. Come on. All right. Man. I'm going to grab a bag. I've never sold nothing in you my life. You can't look at the bag. I'm just going to grab a bag and you have to sell it and you'll do the same for me. That's we'll what we're going to do? We're going to yeah. do a sales test? Let's see how it goes. A promoting test. All right. Okay. Yep. Hold on. You're going to give me a roll of toilet paper probably or something. Uh, don't be looking. All right. Wow, he's what always do you got? Looking, trying to cheat. What do you got? I'm first. All right. So Jimmy just got on the first half with Zoom. <laughs> Zoom? Super fluke. This is a super... You're, I don't you, know what you it want is. Start selling, test. man. Oh, my God. You got to be kidding. Why should I buy this? First of all, I've made probably $30,000 last year on this bait. Really? Thirty grand. i will show you the checks. Okay. God's honest. I'll show you the checks. All right. Thirty grand for that. How are you throwing it? On a rod and a reel. Really? Yeah. 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 I couldn't promote this. Why? It looks too much like a bubble gum, dude. I don't know, man. So you're not into that? I ain't into that. So one. you just lost. I lied too. Oh man. And I lied to you. I don't like that one. No good. 
These belong where those other buzz baits went. <laughs> trash. Get rid of them. You sell them. I, I can't sell something I don't believe in I'm because don't... I'm waiting for fishing season. I really enjoy wearing this jersey. I like it more than ever. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> it's 13 degrees here. It's not 13, it's 34. 34, Give it's still take. cold. My boat's still buried in that much snow. Well, we got our first snowstorm of the year in oh. March. Isn't that amazing? I haven't shoveled all year. I haven't wore this jersey all year. No. Mm -mm. But I do like it. Well, you're sponsored now. You got dirty jigs, eggs. Oh, look it. What Remember else I got? Buddy Steely Dan? Oh, yeah. Get bit baits. That's him? Yeah, Good old Steely. The He's a steelhead fisherman. That's I remember from right, Steely right. Dan, yeah. Yeah. He wasn't a thief, he was a steelhead fisherman. Right, right. Yeah, that's this is really nice, dude. It fits great. Uh-huh. How can this fit me when it used to fit you? Because you're like two people bigger than me in I don't general. Know. I like them a little tight, I guess. Well. Just saying. Yeah. I like it. Extremely serious. Let's just take a look at what it really costs <laughs> yes. to fish. A semi-pro, we want to call it semi-pro, right? Because well, We already I, talked about the BFL level. Yes, let's go to Costas. The Costas are the opens. You call it Costa, I call it Costa. Right. <laughs> you call it vodka, I call it let's go get some. Right. All right, so the cost, here's the deal. Or the Bass Opens. Or the Opens, yeah, yep. the Bass, Northern Opens. We would fish the Northern Series, right? I, I'd love to fish all mm. of them. Great schedule this year, by the way, for Costa. For Costa? Yeah, Bass Costa. is horrible. Well, they keep going to that James. Why do they do that? My, James is my first name, and I don't like it. Right. I'm just telling you. I don't know. I all guess right. it draws a crowd. It does. It is what it is. You just got to get through it. So anyway, here's the deal, all right? The entry fees are $1,600, right? Are they? I think they are now. Okay. 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 So let's just say you're fishing three. Okay. It's $1,600 times three is $4,800. Gotcha. $4,800. Just an entry fees. All right. That's more than most people make in a month. Just saying. In okay. a month. In a month. All right. right. Okay. Going down to gas, food, hotel, which would be your expendables. Okay. Well, you got this all. I, I wrote it all down. All right. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. So you're looking at about two fifty a week for that. Two fifty for gas. Uh, uh, what do I do here? Two fifty for gas, food, and hundred and five hundred. Um, it's eight fifty for the week total. Your gas is two fifty. Your, your hotel's going to be at least five hundred. So look, how many days are you practicing? Five. And how many days are you fishing? Five. So you're just fishing five days? This is if you don't make the cut even. So you're get, is, you get there Monday, Tuesday? Wednesday. Wednesday, and the tournament's Thursday, Thursday Friday. Friday. Let's just say you don't make the cut. All right, five days. Five days. I got five days. I wrote it down. Five days. Well, that's not a lot of it's practice two fifty. It's $2.15. If get, you're going to drop $4,800 a year, you only give yourself th two and a half days of practice? No, I go on Saturday. Well, then it's going to be more. But the weekends don't count. Why? I don't know, because it's not a work day. It has to count. Well, then we're in big trouble. <laughs> right. You're I'm taking the minimums. It's $100 to, to stay overnight somewhere. Yeah, I got that. $500. Okay. $250 for gas and fuel. For the whole week? And 100 Yeah. A 50-gallon gas tank times 3 bucks a gallon is 150 right there. Yeah, I don't run that much out in a day. I limit myself. Uh, you're gonna need five, six hundred. Okay. Years. Anyway, it's about the coast is going to Lake Champlain, mm -hmm. uh, Lake Ontario. Yep. Potomac. Right. You're gonna be making some runs in practice. You better up that. All right. Let's just say the total. Five hundred in gas. Okay. Let's. Just, okay. Good. So the total for the week is five hundred in gas, five hundred in hotels, and two hundred in food. 300 in food, probably. Three hundred. Okay. Three hundred. So you got. If you're not going out to eat. Thirteen hundred dollars. Plus the forty eight hundred. What about the gas to drive to the place? I didn't count that. Add another four hundred on there. I can't count that high, bro. Now we're to nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty. So eighteen hundred. For what? I don't know. No. Just give anyway, me a number. Let's go. Ten grand. <laughs> so it's gonna cost you ten, 10 grand, grand to okay. fish three tournaments. Ten grand, which means you have to cash on average mm -hmm. thirty or three thousand fifty. Just to break even. Gotcha. In three events. So top 10 at least. Yeah. Minimum. Yeah. You got to make the cut in every one of them. Sounds good. I think we could do it. A lot it. of guys do it for a hobby. They're not Why are you money. fishing at this level for a hobby? Because it's just fun. It's something to do. You're not trying to get... You're trying to make money doing that? I think you are. I think the only reason why you fish the Opens is one, to qualify <coughs> for the Elite Series. Right. 
Why do you fish the FLW? To, I guess you can qualify, qualify for, for that, what? The tour. The, the FLW tour. Yeah, it's just that, yeah. I, they, they let anybody fish. I think now you have to get invited or something. Oh, you do now. Because anybody used to be able to fish. Remember, if you had the money, turn green, you I were guess. In. I don't know if that's the case. Hmm. I just know the Opens. Yeah. The only reason why you fish an Open is to qualify for the Elites, in my opinion. Birth of the Classic, if it's your dream. Or the Forest Elwood Cup on the FOW or side, the side Cup. right? Well, I think you have to go to a regional or a championship. You do. You have to go to a championship at the end okay. of the year, which is free. Right. But you still got to get there, eat, put gas in the boat, and then get home. Sure. But it's free. So I think a lot Bass, of this... Bass doesn't just offer doing it a free... To have a good time and compete. There's nothing it's in the hobby. Open... It's there's nothing hobby, in. Yeah. There's nothing in the Opens that give you a free event. Nothing. No. But if you win, right, you can go to the Bassmaster Classic. Yeah, I think this is more of a hobby. Bass fishing in general. Uh, yes. <laughs> I really think it is, yeah. Most of the top names... So I don't really want this jersey anymore. <laughs> I'm no, done. Most of the pros out there, you know, they, they have a business, right? Yeah. They have money yeah. backing them. It costs 100000 plus to fish on the Elite Series a year. My God. Sponsorship has come around a lot better than when I qualified for the elite. I was, I qualified during the time when the economy was going bad. Yeah, two thousand nine, ten, eleven, ten. 12. The banks fell apart. Everything. Yeah, it, yeah. Was, it was a bad time for sponsorship. Did Next you borrow time, money to improved. fish? How'd you do that? A little bit of borrowed. Yeah. My first year, I got a full ride, and then um, I had to borrow a little bit of loot the second year. Yeah, but. It's a hobby. It's a hobby. You're not going to make any yeah. money. It's not like poker. Oh, I don't know. Or gambling. I try to stay out of the casino hall. I hear you. Try. Try. So, we pretty much summed it up. Don't, you can't make any money bass fishing. It's a hobby. Well, I don't know um, if I go off of these. But who spends, sit down who spends $52,000 on a hobby, bro? If it's a hobby, why not fish out of a gun runner like you did in Wisconsin? A gun runner. I don't know. Whatever those boats are called. Gun of whales? I don't think I ever gun fished runner? a gun runner. What are they? I have no idea. Like a... With the, a gun runner. Whatever the aluminum... Uh, pontoon boat? Why not fish out of a pontoon John boat? boat? A John boat. It's John, lot, Bill, whatever. It's a, lot, it's a lot more fun fishing out of a bass boat. Yeah, but it's a hobby. Look at people that golf as a hobby. They buy very expensive equipment. I've golfed as a hobby. Right? It didn't cost me nowhere near as much as, uh, as fishing. Uh, you might have... I got a thousand bucks wrapped up in my golf clubs. I can't swing any of them, but I only got a thousand bucks Well, then you have uh, golf club fees. Yeah, golf club fees. You, <laughs> you mean, I don't you, you mean rounds. You, pay, you, you buy a round of golf, and right. it's anywhere from 40 to 200. Yeah. Okay, I get it. Right. An entry fee is 1,600. I can golf... Nine rounds, right? Nine times two is what? It costs eighteen hundred dollars to golf. If you would play, no, it doesn't. I not even close. That's, That's crazy. Question. Oh, I don't. I'm not. I'm not easily fooled, bro. Okay. Trust okay. me. I got my numbers right here. All right. Got it all figured out. Golfing is great because you can actually fish when you golf. You can. There's a lot of ponds on yeah, there it. There you go. Yeah. So you can do both for less right, money. Right, right. Why not golf and fish the ponds? I like the competition. I just spit. I, I mean, the only reason why I would. I mean, I am. I'm fishing Northern Opens. I'm. Hopefully, going to be able to get into NIDA. I'm on the waiting list right now. Oh, really? But You're already to... jammed that much? Nah, they just scary. A I think bit. they do that on purpose. Yeah. Yeah, keep it real. Say next time. Oh, all of a sudden, congratulations, now. you made it, right? Yeah. yeah. It'll be all, right. all right, guys, I have no idea what we just discussed or talked about. It's just a random thing. Random we were stuff, talking about jerseys, fishing. tournaments, expenses. Yeah. Don't quote us on the numbers. We never, we never talked about doc talk. Not yet. That's a good one, too. Hey, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Give us any comments below. Let us know what you think of Jimmy's jersey. And if his real name's Big Crank or Big Jim or Big Time. Jimmy Big Time. You'll see it this year on my boat. Until next Jimmy time. Jimmy Big Time. Peace.